Hi, Hi everyone. I'm Gary. I'm Ronnie. We are Garon Stitchery. The home. Oops. Hi, Hi everyone. Y'all. I'm Ronnie. I'm Gary, and we are Garon Stitchery. The house of Garon Totten Bags. <laughs> <laughs> Hi everyone. Hi. I'm Gary. I'm Ronnie. We are Garon Stitchery. The house of Garon Totten Bags. <laughs> Got it this time. Yeah. It only took three times. Yeah. All right. Uh, welcome back. If you are a new subscriber, a new viewer, we are a floss tube about uh, stitching, and we are shop owners and shop and makers. So uh, we'll have a little bit of different things in our videos than normal floss tubers. We'll have a little bit about what we're doing, a little bit about new what's in the shop, and um, other things that come up. <laughs> yes. So. We normally do a weekly video that comes out every Friday night, Saturday morning, depends on how long it takes to upload it. But we did not have one last week, as many of you know. Because uh, we were at StitchCon. Yes, it was so much fun. It's yes. it's the most enjoyable part about being a stitcher, I think, is the, um, we, we call it stitching, but it's actually socializing. <laughs> <laughs> Socializing for a weekend. Well, I don't know you, but I didn't stitch this time. Yeah, well, I, I, did, <laughs> I did more socializing than anything else. Yes. You know, this time, I don't know what's wrong with me, but, you know, I'm crazy. No. But it was so hard contact, uh, make contact with names and faces. was bad. I was talking to a sweet girl. And I was talking there, and there when I look in her her tag name, and it's hard to make what look in their tag name because the tag name is over here. <laughs> yeah, everyone's watching. Sorry, around. everybody's watching around looking at your booth. Yes, I was like, oh and my god. And I said, oh my god, you're Patricia. And I had a nice shot with our, our dear friend Patricia. Okay, next next time, all the name tags should be on the forehead. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> really, it's hard. It was hard for yeah. me. And I'm I'm feeling like a little shy, mm -hmm. Ronnie shy. Wow. And I don't go to many tables because when I'm going to the table, I I can't. I don't know what what was with me this time. Mm -hmm. But sorry, yeah, I'm not coming to your table and say hi. But I was, yeah. no, wasn't my. And I think I was I was the opposite. I was I couldn't sit down. I yeah. was I could not sit down. I'm like I, I do like two three stitches and I'm like oh I gotta go see what's going on over there. Yes, it was like you. all over the place. Thank you, our viewers who come into our table and say hi. It was mm -hmm. so kind of you. Yeah. And it was a lovely meeting many, many, many mm -hmm. new people. They are in our group and our uh, customers, our viewers. Mm -hmm. What was really and, what was really fun for me was like a lot of many of the people we had just spent the week the, the week before at Stitching in the Wild and then we were like, Hey, we're back together again. It's yeah. like we skip a weekend and we're back together. It was yes. really fun. Yeah, it was it was wonderful meeting yeah. a lot of people. And a lot of flow stewards. Mm -hmm. Holy macaroni. And designers. There was a lot of designers. And designers. Yeah. Yes. And yes. There was a lot this of designers was... that were participants as, as stitchers. So it was kind of fun. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I had the chance to meet a couple of new stitchers too. Mm -hmm. And can't wait to get their, well, we already got their charts. We already got we it. We got some. We got some <laughs> yes. charts. Yes. All right. So let's, um, we actually have a big announcement. Uh, okay. a, a mini announcement. We're we're over three thousand. Yes, yeah, three thousand and one. <laughs> yes, thank you, thank you, thank, thank you, you, everyone for subscribing. Yes, yes. And uh, we go doing a um, drawing next week, probably. Right. Well, well no, we go and ask what we go drawing next week. We have to plan in. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but for now, we going back to. Uh, let's go back to. Th um, Let's go back to um, fellow, fellow floss tubers. Oh, yeah. Yes. We had, um, within the last week, we had three shout outs from fellow floss tubers. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Uh, the first one is Stitches with Granny. Um, she actually, I think she chatted us out while we are at StitchCon. So it was during that uh, period. Okay. So it was a little bit longer than what we normally look back at. And so we didn't forget about you. We just weren't here to say thank you. <laughs> And then the uh, next one is uh, Robin from Bird's Eye, Bird's Eye Stitcher. Oh, thank you, thank Robin. You, Robin. And then um, a new one here is um, 
recovering mono monogamous mm -hmm. stitcher and actually i met we met her at stitchcon yes yeah so it was kind of fun to you know to to meet up and uh and then now i'm gonna subscribe i don't know how i missed her but i yeah. will definitely be catching up on some floss tubes in uh in a stitchcon we mm -hmm. meet um oh I, what was her name the floss tuber she make a video with all the floss tubers one by one okay oh yeah we'll put that at the end where um yes. there was a group of floss tubers that got together and we all did a, a walk through shout out kind of thing about our channel that's cool so it was really fun uh, it wasn't everybody there was more floss tubers there than what showed through but it was uh it was a good random portion i think people yeah. were, were schedules and stuff they weren't all there so it was so it would have been really funny if we had everybody because they did a photo of all of Lost Tubers on the steps. And I'm like, I looked around I'm like, oh, wow. You almost cannot see me in the picture. Yeah. I was yeah. Uh, behind um, What's this? Uh, the first step, but he was in front of me. Yeah. It was a big guy. Yeah. And a little guy. <laughs> but yeah, yeah it was. Uh, Papa, yeah. no. There was, a, there was a lot of guy stitchers they're more than normal and they were floss tubers so it's kind of nice to see you know we're breaking in <laughs> yes yes I'm, I'm i'm enjoying that a lot yeah it's everyone, around maybe what 10 or 15 maybe 10 males maybe 10 males 10 yeah around 10 males mm -hmm. stitching there and yeah. what maybe four floss tubers or three well with two of us I don't know. Yeah. It, it, yeah. You know, you're talking about math on, on camera. <laughs> don't get me wrong. <laughs> uh, yeah. It, there were over 300 people. They they told us 300, but there was like 325. Yeah. So, um, we, I'm thinking what they say was uh, 325 people for weekend A. Yeah. And I believe it would be the same for weekend B. I'm not sure. But yeah, probably. Yes. That's a lot of, yeah, that was a lot of people. But it was fun. Is uh, this gone? Have a beautiful bag. You, you got the back side. Backwards. Isn't it cool? Yeah. Very steady, very good. It's like a. Um, groceries or. Was it like felt or wool? Is it like a wool bag? I don't know. I don't know what material it is, but it's Super very cool. strong. And I know Barbara and her team, they, they really knocked it out of the park this year. It was when really you come fun. into the to the front desk, you got it this with your name. Mm hmm. And Sai is uh, the the book. Well, no, they call it the passport. Yeah, they call it the passport with with the instructions uh -huh. what is going and on. And you were supposed to read week. it, but as you can tell, we did not read it. Yeah. And read it that night. <laughs> I last did. night. I was going to read it, but then you know they were talking. There was a lot of errors in it, so I was like, ah, I'll yeah. just I'll just and play it by the year. They're coming. I put it on one bag only because. Yeah. That one, I got it. That yeah. one in my bag oh, too. This was really cool. Uh, there was two two ladies from Just Cross Stitch there, and they were they off. They gave everybody a Just Cross Stitch magazine, this this issue, and they they talked to. They did like a, a like a breakout session, you know, kind of like a corporate world where they talk to you and try to get feedback of what you're looking for, what you like, what what can change, or what you know opportunities and stuff. And so I thought it was really fun. I'm. There was a lot of us, quite a bit of us that was there um, that, you know, gave some good feedback and they seemed very receptive. And so um, I think it'll be kind of cool. It, it showed, you know, shows that, you know, magazines are tough because with this new digital world, it's hard to be a magazine company, but uh, they look like they're trying. And, uh, and I'm really excited to see what's coming down the pipeline from them. Yeah, and this magazine is, uh, yes, 20 projects mm -hmm. to dig. Yeah. And uh, when uh, they are table uh, mates, I'm thinking... Will. No, it's not this one. She had the other one. So, oh. yeah. So what I love about the no, magazine no. is on the back. In the last page, they show all the projects that's in the, in the magazine. And if you collect magazines and you say, you know what? I forget to stitch out of them. You need to join um, Carolyn Zook's um, monthly magazine challenge Facebook group. And she puts out an acrostic. And it's a word, and then you gotta find a patterns out of the magazine to meet the letters of the word. I think I explained that right, Carolyn. If not, she'll definitely correct me because she does a flip through of this book every time. So I did, I did, Carolyn. I'm sorry, I did 
tell them about your Facebook group <laughs> and they were very interested in checking out your Facebook group about the magazine monthly challenge. And no be surprised if they contact you or not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And there you got it your uh tag name. Ta uh, <gasps> this is, uh, it's my chicken. It is the tags. Don't mind another needle, my little chicken. Okay. And they're coming, there's no in my bag. For some reason I'm missing mine. Mm -hmm. Um, it's a, maybe okay. This was really um, fun because we had no idea. There was like, it was a, in a little bag. We're like, okay, what is this? What did we do with this? Do you because it was like, I'm trying to eat with it. Like, how do I get chips with it? It's kind of hard to get the chip in there. And then someone said, that's an eyeglass cleaner. So I'm like, look at that. That was kind of cool. I like that. Yeah, this is definitely okay. a keeper. And each bag come in these kind of pens, very cool pens. And I have to say, I'm thinking. I'm thinking, and it's still one accidentally from our table mates no. because I had three. Oh, but I was, <laughs> someone gave me the green one. They, they, they everyone else had red one, but someone traded. Here, you need the green one. I didn't see any green ones there, but somehow yeah. I got a green one. They all write black. That was fun. Yeah, but I have one extra. I'm thinking it's from our table mates, oh. and this is scary because mine is missing in my bag. Oh. I don't got in mine in, in my okay. bag and so, everybody say, go, go in the front desk and say, do you know how they say no. Yeah. So um, every, every time they, Barb and them, they always do like an Ohio souvenir. Yeah. Last year it was a, a clear ornament that you put your warts in. Yeah. And the year before it was like a little felt bird. So I, I, I really enjoy to see what they do every year. Yeah. I'm using my glass cleaner and my thing, but it's fine. And, um, I just. Put it on this here. So we're gonna All put right. a little bag here. We're... And the freebie table, Gary found this. Oh, okay. So the freebie table was was actually kind of fun. Uh, people, some people got a lot of really cool things from there. But I saw a lady toss this up there, and I'm like, what is this? What's this? So it was. It's an actually. It's a completely completely kitted project. So it's a nice uh, 32 count linen. Uh, I think it's called Mama Bear, because that's what the tag said. And then there's like called for floss and buttons. And it's a, it was a free design from Kathy Haberman uh, called Surrender the Treats. You know, it just happened to be a Halloween pattern while I was standing there to get dropped off, which was kind of, I thought it was pretty cool. So I thought about also adding some bones on there so the girls can enjoy Halloween. So bones and candy corn. Cool. So, so it's a complete little, I've been wanting to stitch this project for a while and I'm like, this, okay, it's meant to be, I gotta stitch it. Yeah. And the freebie table, I found this. The person who bring it, you see this video, thank you so much. I love it. It was up there for like two days and Ryan said, okay, I, she, she's calling me. I gotta take it's, her home with me. It's gonna be in my Christmas tree for years to come because yeah. I have one angel made it like this. Uh huh. And it's one uh, lady and pieces day grandma we call in in the, in the apartments when when I live uh -huh. before I meet Gary, and uh, she made me one, and I still have it for what two thirty something years thirty years maybe something around that yeah I'll lay that over there sorry. okay this <laughs> nobody knows what it's for. It's a uh, give us from Janelle. Okay, let me tell you this. Sorry, no, so that is the last name. Oh, it's fine. Uh, okay. so no, it's fine because no, no, everybody no, it's, knows it's their okay. name. Uh, Janelle won one of the baskets, Joe's basket, who's uh, the husband of Barb, who made who drives the stitchy bus, and she won the basket from the drawing from the name tag, and this was in her basket, and she said, "Well, clearly it's for you guys because it's our color." Yeah. But she said for you to play tonight. <laughs> I uh, I still don't know what that means, but anyway, uh, it's a nice color. Yeah. Um. There, somebody passed. This is Gary's, mm -hmm. and this is mine. Cute we got scissors. his scissors. Yeah. And uh, we got needle mine there from. This is from... The coolest, many people put their name in there. Yeah, and, and that's that's a takeaway for us, too, to make sure we we let people know. You know, put your name on this stuff, because we everyone goes home and they say, like, oh, who was this? This is the strangest, strange... Stitchers. Strangest Stitchers. 
and it made a little TV night needle minder. Yeah. There, uh, this is the, the frost tubers. Uh, I have yeah. Their name. And I had their name yeah. right out. It's a little know? green, little green guy. <laughs> yeah. But. Gary had another one. This yeah. is mine. Oh. And somebody do a, a needle minder with uh, old money. Oh, sure. Sorry. This was this is a German money. It's ten finnings, and it was back before uh, the euro and back when it was West Germany and East Germany. I know a little bit about history. Yeah, this is a uh, Ricky made this uh, little um, ladybug. ladybug, and I love ladybugs. A needle minder. Uh, this uh, was Megan and her mother. Made this uh, little oh, minder. And I got the chicken. Yeah. And there, uh, one table, I'm sorry, I cannot remember. They were up in the front. They had uh, alphabet needle minders and wood. Mm -hmm. Now, of course, I got it the R and Gary got it the G. Yeah. But it's somewhere. It's somewhere in the house. Yeah. There, uh, happy station, Sheila. Sheila, she did uh, boo boo brushes for everybody. Yeah. So it's kind of cool because there's a little purple frog and a little boo boo brush. It was a theme. And, and, and this, uh, what, okay, if, if you're not into uh, bad words, you might want to look away for now. Uh, but this is what they called it uh, Diane. Yeah. We'll Diane did this. Yeah. So. I mean, many of us have said that. Brush too. Have said that when we had the frog. There, this one was made by Happy um, Mary and April. They made these little. This was, Just living that way. This was it? mine. It's a little gummy frog, little gummy yeah, frog, and a, fro and a frogger and a nail foul. This many nail fouls are lifesavers when you're out in the in traveling and stitching. Because you always get a hangnail at the last, at the wrong time. Lame pass with this. Uh, That's mine. Threads. Now this is mine. Yours are darker. Oh. Yeah. She passed with. Uh, we, she's saying you need green. Ah. She had all the colors. Uh, this one was. JBW. JBW. Um, Judy. You can open that one. Okay, this one I can open. Ooh. So she did her um, some thread drops. And what's nice about this size, it, we were talking about it. What? I'm fine, the G. I told you it was here. <laughs> <laughs> it's stuck in this bag. Yeah. So what's nice about this is she put the floss color name, floss and color on there. But you know what? You can always put more holes on this big size one. And this could be a floss card for one full project. So like if you had like something with only seven colors or six colors, I thought that was really fun. All right. This one was made for us from um, Chris. Chris. Chris come in um, to me and say, Ronnie, this time I'm put a tag because I'm stitching in the wild, you, you say my, wrong my name. Yeah. <laughs> she do me. It's cute because they, now we know who is what. Yeah. But she made this for us. This is for me. And this one's for me, little worm. American Heart. Yeah. This, this is what yeah. I mean. It's super cute. It's super and nice. And you remember it, and and um, and then you can send your thank yous out. And mine coming with my candy. Oh, oh my God, candy! I had tons if of he, candy. If he wasn't diabetic when he went to StitchCon, he came home diabetic. Yeah. All right. This one mm. go here. This one is give us to us from Andrea. She give us each one a chocolate. And you mine? This is mine. <laughs> I have mine. Did, did I eat mine? Probably, I don't um, know. I don't know where they were all Elvis themed because you know she's yeah. from Hong Kong, Hong Kong, burning love. This was um, mini mini gray. mini gray. She passed these bracelets. Yeah, the white bracelet is for um, it's uh, faith, hope, hope, love, strength, and it's white is for lung cancer. Yeah, she's um, recovering. Yeah, and and our prayers you. are with you, Minnie. Yes. This one's this uh, Tiger Lily Designs. Yep, it's a boo boo. It's a boo boo brush and a project card. And a okay. Now that's pretty cool. Nice little project card there. I like that. This one somebody giving to you. Mm hmm. 
Yeah, we were able to, they were a, a group of them we were able to pick, I think, if I remember right. So, these are so cool. All yeah. the jewelry, all the jewelry. This I call jewelry, it all jewelry was made for, for uh, everybody in the Stitch Con. Yeah, this was what they call make it and take it. Yes, you made and your own uh, scissor you, frog. You put it together. It's got a little bicycle, the, the year, a little black cat because they're known for their little cat called 310. And then you can use it as scissor fob. Every year they make another yeah. neat little one. That's really kind of fun. This one was passed by Margaret. 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 She made, she actually she made, made those. I talked to her. She made the um, yeah. waxers. Yeah. And again. somebody sent us so well, with things. Gary sent me this one. And I got the green one. And he don't remember the name, but thank you so much. He's coming and say, she said you cannot count. Here is for you to count him. She might have said that or I might have said that. What well, he said, <laughs> um, this one is made by... Gina, our table mate. Gina, our table mate. And she made everybody a little bee. Yes. That is so cool. And uh, I don't know how you guys can do that. The little bitty stitching. There. They have one, um, a cute um, thousand hearts. Oh, yes. And isn't the car here? There was a couple of people who... I hope it's in the car. Yeah, there was a couple of people who got together and helped them make a thousand hearts. And for and this is kind of weird because I actually got the one that Gina made. Okay, you can read this yeah. for me. So, um, uh, this pocket heart has been lovingly handmade as part of 1,000 hearts to share and celebrate kindness. Keep it close and give it a squeeze when you need a reminder of love, hope, courage, and comfort. It's the thousand, yeah. and that's the thousand hearts. Yeah. So, and I had I had her autograph it for me. Our uh, teammate, table mate, Andrea, uh, Becky, Becky, I'm sorry, Becky and Gina are participating in that uh, yeah, thousand was, hearts. Yeah, it's around six or eight ladies mm -hmm. in the stitch cone. Yeah. It's, it's a global it. kindness. And there's a website. I'll put that website in the drop down if you guys want to go take a look and see what that's all about. Yeah. Okay, I, I need to put that right. here so I remember. <laughs> there we have a uh, scissor, scissor fog. Yeah, this one is a coffee. Oh, well, it's Janelle, Janelle too. Yeah. Janelle who give us the... The rope. The rope. So this is like a little coffee, mm -hmm. um, coffee cup themed with little beans and stuff. And I thought this was cool because it looked like a pumpkin, so it kind of went with everything. This was uh, Sarah. Um, hold on, Sarah Memphis. Memphis Sarah. Plus she sugar. she make uh, this yeah. scissor fog. Yeah, she, she gave me. I think that's the Ohio colors. She gave me this one personally to me. Yeah, very cool. There, uh, Becky, our table mate, give us uh, scissors with a scissor fog. Mm -hmm. You see, here is the thread. She made this one for me because there is the thread. Yeah. And thank you, Becky. And there, someone giving this one to you. Yep. This one was a, with a little jack-o'-lantern. Mm-hmm. And it's got the glass candy corn. We have a tons of thread drops. If you didn't have candy in your mouth, you could actually speak properly so people could understand you. But I don't have so candy in my mouth. It's in your cheek now. <laughs> so anyway, so we're, we'll just show a couple of these as we go through because this yeah. is the theme now oh, now for retreats is it's something really fun and you can use you can use them or or group them together and put them on a big project. So this is from Connie. This one is from Lori. And they put their names yeah. on the back. We didn't put our names on the back of ours. This, no, but this they is have from, a picture. This um, is Cynthia. And we do our uh, sis, uh, and I, thread I, drops with... The girls. The girls' picture, a picture with the mask that we have in the video, and a logo. Yeah. And this, yeah. I know this is from, um... Mega Mother, Stacy? Tracy. Tracy, Tracy. Yeah. Sorry, Tracy. <laughs> and then, um, uh, this one right here is from Carol. Thank you, Carol. 
I don't have their names and they're, um, they're all on the back of their cards. I had the the sisters' names. Write it up this because is, I forgot. This is AJ. Cool. Oh, AJ did also a needle a needle uh, the um leather little leather thing. Um, what is it? It was really facet. No. Oh no, it's here. Okay, yeah. Here. So AJ AJ made this and that, and she gave us this sweet little story because she had to tell everyone. Uh, she knows she's not in Wakanda because when she made this, she made it for weekend A, and her daughter was saying, "Mom, why did you put Wakanda?" I think it was her mom or someone had said, "Why did you put Wakanda?" So for me, forever, I was in weekend A, which was Wakanda. <laughs> Thank you, AJ. And AJ was a little fresh. I got a picture at the end to show you. The sisters, and the sister, the sisters. Mm -hmm. What was their names? Um, I have it write it up. You didn't put it with the thingy. No, that is not this. No. There's other sisters. My turn is okay. showing that. So this this is from uh, two. We had two twins sisters at the retreat. I'm glad this too. Yeah, two twins. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, it'd be something other than twins, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and this is the Sorry. this is. The recovering uh, monogamous stitcher. <laughs> Some, okay. people. Some people. All right. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure who did this one. And then this one. Yeah, right that, here one is... that one. Oh, I you're sure? really showed okay. that one. Um, I. I just. Had... I would put it the names here because I know okay. that. Uh, Sorry, sisters. I, I I know who you are. You sit at the table behind us. And she and, made me. And I talked to this you beautiful rose. during the week. And look at this little skeleton. That is so cute. Yeah. Thank you so much. You. Yeah. I have a mine and, and wrapping it in I, my... I know she doesn't do social mm -hmm. media, but she does watch. So Yeah, but the other sister. Oh, well, I'm putting them together sisters. so I can put them back in my project. Yeah, they're from Virginia. Uh, Virgi yeah, Virginia. Virginia. Yeah. Yes. I'll put that up there. Somewhere. All right. Someone passed, give us this. Lovely son. I gotta figure out what yeah. what I, oh you put it on your scissors. Yeah. Oh okay. I was trying and to figure there, it out. There another free I made this little oh sorry. This little hand with a button. Yeah, and she was telling us what's really cool about this is it, it the little hand says handmade. So when you make a little pin pillow or a little um berry. You could pin this on your project that says it's handmade. Mm -hmm. And this is Bridget. And uh, Bridget made me this one. Yeah. She says she loved it in, in a retreat. Um, Debbie, Debbie made. made it. And uh, she had to copy her because she loved it so much. Mm -hmm. And she made me one. And I'm using all the time. I'm in a stitch con. And I'm telling you, look, prove that I'm using it. <laughs> all right. Okay. Here is your exchange. Oh, did you want to finish that stuff? Because isn't that more of this stuff from the table? Uh, you can do the exchange. Okay. All right, we're gonna. This is it. We're gonna confuse you guys because this was the small. Okay. Let me go back to my bag. Okay. Lori, Lori, make us. She was in a retreat. She was a lovely car, and she was in a retreat, and um, she. And Terry take a picture with us with her um, garron bags. That they wanted. I had to trip. stand out for sure, you guys. And she make us yeah. this beautiful. Isn't that beautiful? That's a, that's a whole lot of, uh, <laughs> yeah. it's gorgeous. And say, stitching in the wall in the top. Yeah. But I love it so much. And um, we take People take pictures of us, three of us with the blanket, mm -hmm. and we cannot find it. And yeah. I forgot to handle my phone for do that. Yeah, there were pictures being <laughs> taken everywhere. Okay, when we leave in for the stitch con, we got it a uh, beautiful uh, card, a beautiful package, present package or present from, from Susan. Susan. I forget what, what city, what state, but... Oh, uh, yeah. So, 
Yeah, uh, Susan, thank, you, thank you, Susan, because I ate a bag on the way up to... This is a chocolate. This is chocolate espresso mix. And this one this is... This is my candy. <laughs> <laughs> yep. And, and then uh, the next one is... is um, on the back. Gummies? Uh, Sunkissed sun -kissed fruit gummies. Yes. Gems. And that one come in with this beautiful... Candy dish. Candy dish. Green. It's, it's the uh, it's the approved Galran color, so I'm gonna be in the and office. This other one. Yeah. Thank you. I mean, this was really amazing. And this, uh, thank you, thank you, Susan, so very much. Yeah. We love it. Yep. Susan, you did you did give me a little startle because there was you know I looked at my informed delivery and said I'm just getting a box from somewhere and I'm like, what did I order? What did I order? <laughs> yeah. I'm thinking I'm out of the picture, Gary. Well, you're in. Um, I'm gonna stand up. Yeah. This is a, a present from Aura mm -hmm. with a lovely. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, so this, this is... is Gary. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, this ha this is what happens at Christmas too. Yeah, this is Gary and this is mine. I I I I. This is the card. Thank you, Aura. And, and, and it'll be stapled on Ronnie's wall down in this building. Yes, of course. Oh my gosh, look at this beautiful. <clears throat> yeah, many of these we know open in the Stitch Kong. We just yeah. got it in. in uh, Thank you. I love the coming personal with uh, chocolates. A chocolate from. This is raisins, and that's malt balls. Chocolate yeah. covered raisins. Yeah. And then she made her uh, thread drops. And and she put holes. Oh, wow. And she said she put holes in them this time for me. Yeah. But look, she threw in some without holes. <laughs> yeah. She right for put it. Yeah. What did you project? That's really cool. Thank you, Abuelita. All right. I can't remember who made this. I'm sorry. But uh, she bring it to our table. Mm -hmm. She made this art, like an art. Yeah. Have a magnet here for your needle. Or scissors. I don't, I don't know where it come in this one from. We want some, something else. I think this is the one needle mine there in. Yeah. Oh, Nancy. Oh, Nancy. I'm putting Thank the name Nancy. there, Nancy. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. write the name there because I can't go for God. Yeah. And see, and then a uh, tape measure. This would be yeah. cool. So yeah. you can measure your project. Yeah. Yeah. Um, See, he does, he does use his brain sometimes. It's not just a pretty face. <laughs> Nothing a beauty face. <laughs> this was my present from... Jackie. Jackie. Mm -hmm. And she gave me... Oh. And he, and he broke into it like a rat. She gave me three bags. On my candy, I had two in the in the shutdown. I just leaving here one for showing. And then she gave us Starbucks coffee yeah. cups. Um, I'm thinking about a different. Yeah, this one's yeah. Washington. And this is my this is Seattle. Seattle. Yeah. I'm thinking brand. Look in that brand. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah. um, thank you, Jackie. Oh. Candy, no, no, wait, 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 wait. Candy is here. Hold on, hold on. Be careful, be careful, because it's good, it's the gold. <laughs> yeah, my bag, I open the bag and... Okay. All right. Yeah. There, Jackie, pass this. This is Jackie, hold on, let me check something. See if there's something inside. Okay. And think... <laughs> Okay. I think it's Jackie. I your bag. Yeah. So it's a notepad. Uh, me tape measure. Yeah. File. Now, oh, band-aids. Could, I could have used those. I didn't oh, even notice. Oh, wait. Um, I'm thinking I got the bandage from here, from Lisa. Oh. Um, somebody. Yeah, this is Jackie. Uh, yeah. 
It's this gone 2023. Yeah, this yeah, one was Jackie like, and she uh, have a yeah. chocolate. Yeah, green pan. Almond and Russia pen. chocolate. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's the least what, what is in the bag. I know that. And then we have and a lamp, two. Yeah, well, the, these lint brushes are really good to uh, remove the stuff from your stitching, like um, when you have to frog. Yeah, we have two. There we have here. I don't know, this one was you. Here is your chocolate from Andrea. <laughs> See, I kept putting things inside of things. I knew I had chocolate. Ooh, it's mm -hmm. the other side. So this is a couple, let's see, there's a couple of things in here. Um, this was from Becky. This was from Becky. And this is where my scissors went to. Because I yeah. thought, ooh, I lost my scissors. Uh -huh. But but I kept it all together too. So Becky gave me the scissors. There's a little thing. And then she gave me this little coffin. That's so cute. For the scissors to go in. And then this little project here which is you stitch the top of the skull and here's uh, the skull. Oh, it's so cute. Yeah. And, and you know what? I think Ronnie could stitch it for me. Uh, no. Because look, it's Ada. Uh-huh. Well, it's very simple. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Oh, I love this color. What's that for? Oh, that's for the quarter round. Oh my gosh. Okay, I could whip this up really quick. I'll stitch this. Definitely, I'll stitch this. So I'm say yes, and now he said he could do it. <laughs> you have to finish it. No, but, yeah. I can uh, stitch a little piece of fabric. I have to throw in something around and no. Oh. No. That's so cute. Thank you, Becky. No. Put it that one in this. Give me that bag. Okay. I'm putting my, my, my candy here because the bag is open. I want candy everywhere. All right. This one was made by, let me see his car here before. Okay, this one is when I'm open it. And got a uh, whole bunch of stuff in it from other people. No? Yeah, this one's mine. Oh, that's yours. Yeah, because I, I have a whole bunch of stuff in here. Oh so, my oh. God, that is your. <laughs> yeah, see, I have, I, if I have a bag, I'm gonna stick things in it. This came from Gina. And this, this, so the jack, the jack and the, this were in that bag. I think that one is mine. No. Drink coffee. Oh. And this is my Wakanda and my little heart. Because yours are the... And then that. And this is washi tape that was with that. There is your thread. And, and then this is from... Mm -hmm. This is thread. And this is the Boston, uh, Boston Red Sox, which goes with the that bask bag right there. The little gnome thing. And this is Wakanda. This is Sarah Memphis. See? I, yeah. I am notorious for sticking things in other bags. When, uh, what's her name? Uh, sorry, uh, what's your name? Oh, this is Notorious Needle. She made these little matchbooks. Um, needle okay. things. When Sheila. Sheila. Sheila passed me this bag. She's a, a, a long, long member of Garon Totem Bags. Mm -hmm. She even was in my bag of the month. Anyway, I know her for a long, long, long time. When she passed me these bags, I open mine and I'm looking and have a um, bandage. Oh. Okay. And Lisa. When they are lady girls, she punched herself with the needle when she's close to him. She said she don't know how she passed through the needle. Wow. And um, Daniela in our table, she said, Ronnie, you have bandage. I think it was Daniela. Mm -hmm. And I said, what? He said, yeah, and see when you open the bag. It was bandages? That's what? The bandage was perfect. Yeah. Because I can use it in an emergency yeah. moment. See, and... Um, and oh, she no. made me this one. She gave me this one. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. And uh, your daughter, too. Mm -hmm. I, meet, I meet her daughter for the first time. She's so lovely. 
This one was made special for me mm -hmm. from uh, Patricia. Yeah, it's a rug mug where you yes. put your coffee on it. And Don't she is put a, a stitch con. Mine is a sewing. Yeah, red, red. and mine's sewing blue. Yeah. Let's thank you so much, Patricia. Uh, Patricia. Yeah. Oh, Patricia in Spanish. Yeah. Yeah. All right. And now we going to Gary's. I did a small. I just we did a small exchange, and I need that there. And I um, of course I grabbed this bag. I think Tracy set me up. Yeah. But I like being set up. So um, what was in this? I'm gonna take everything out and I'll show you guys what it was. It's really fun. I love doing the smalls exchange. So this is the project that she stitched. It's a Frankenstein needle book. There's the front and there's the back. And what's really cool is she finished it herself because she said she did all the research on how to make, on make it and everything. And she really had a good time um, figuring it out. And I thought that is so sweet. And then she made this little, um, little Franken pin bucket where you put your needles or pins in there. And then she actually made the needle minder. She made the Frankenstein needle minder. And then she made a companion um, scissor fob. And there you can put your needle here too. Yeah. It's a magnet for the needle. And then I got some more. Um, then she made this is for the thread keep. There's made more cards. So I'll add my other cards to that. And then there's a little beading, a gel beading thing. This is for you to put your beads on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you just wash it when it gets hairy or old and it goes back to life. Cool. And then there's this little box for orts or candy because it says it's food safe. So just, just giving you, letting you know. And so inside is the little um, green peels that you would put on your Valdani um, threads to keep them from rolling. And then some most sales silk in green and blue, a little threader, and a little little piece of paper that says orts. I, I, this is what the, what I love the most about Smalls Exchange is the creativity that people have when they when they make the stuff and they finish it themselves. I love that more than anything else when they when they do their own little finishing and have the story because it'll mean a lot. It means a lot more. And it's cute. And it's super cute. I mean look in there. Put them all together. I love them together. He might make it to my Halloween tree. I mean, I still have the, I, I, what's the funny part is last year I got uh, Megan's um, exchange gift, which is her daughter. <laughs> and that Halloween mouse has been sitting out on, in the living room ever since I got it. Uh, so, coffee table in the living room. Yeah. So yeah. it's, um, it doesn't only come out for Halloween. Yeah. No. Yeah. Um, that is all the goodies from the Stitch Con. Con. But the goodies that you can't see are the ones that mean the most to us. Were uh, probably the million hugs and yes. and the conversations and the love and the um, connections yes. that um, mean so much more to me. Yes, it's and, true. And and I agree, hundred percent. Yeah, Good. thousand percent. <laughs> okay. All right. So that was it from StitchCon. So let's get back to our regularly scheduled program of what are you stitching? Okay. Where did it go up first? We have it all here. Oh, okay. So, um, so my first question is, do you have any finishes? Nah. <laughs> all right, do you have any starts? No. Me neither. All right, let's see your whip. My whip is, I forgot the chart, is uh, with the people, South the Stitches. Mm -hmm. And uh, that was so cool because I put it a lot of stitches in a stitch con. Mm -hmm. And she was there, and she have a trunk show. Yeah. And we take a picture with the, her model mm -hmm. and my progress. Oh, this that's is awesome. When I was 
all here is tray is when I'm was all this is when I stitch. You did all that at stitch, stitch, stitch con? No way. And I just for cur I don't count as teachers. Yeah, stitches. Yes, he does. But for curiosity, I got the shot and I'm counting and I make eighteen hundred stitches on stitch con mm -hmm. in three days. What is a lot for me? That's a lot for yeah. everybody. Yeah, and do all that, all this. That's that's a lot of white yeah. and red. <laughs> and because I'm bring this one, yeah. because it's white and, and it's easy. Uh, white and red, mm -hmm. and I know how to count it. Only I have to be careful, at you the know, end. in the end. Yeah, because go like ladder, mm -hmm. and even in the last row of red. I make a mistake. I'm mm. do two extra stitches. Yeah, stitches. No, in the before the last one. Oh, it's not bad. And there I had to frog two half. Oh, ha oh, because the way you I stitched. I had to frog half for remove that two extra stitches here. Okay. But that's the the only frogging I did in all stitch con. Okay, yeah. that's cool. And I love it because I'm in third page of six. Halfway. Yeah. Halfway. Plus the letters. Yeah. So I, I took this pattern, this project with me, trick or treat, because um, um, I keep I always mess up. Cottage Garden Samplings is our designer of the month for for um, June, and I'm I did it all. On, I'm working on thirty six count ducks Duxbury by Fox and Rabbit, and this is where I'm at. So at uh, StitchCon, I did the, just, I did the square. I it took me four days, but I did finish the whole square of that one. Wow. And then when I came home, uh, we came home, what? Sunday. Sunday. So but for this week, I, I just worked on, I just did this square. So this is, um it's a very deceptive project because... You think, oh, it's it should be going pretty quick, but it takes about a week for me to do one of those little squares. Mm -hmm. So, um, and today is the 16th. So that means I need to start, I need to pick up, actually yesterday I was supposed to pick up my um, Halloween at Hawkman Hollow, but we had a day without electricity. So, um, yes. so my about, stitching was reduced. I still stitched in the dark. How about that? Yeah, we have a horrible storms in our neighborhood. Yeah. But uh, we 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 did pretty good. We just had no light, so that's yeah. the if that's the worst of it, I can live with that. Um, I didn't see any damage in the neighborhood, mm -mm. so we mm -mm. you know our neighbors were, were pretty safe too. So um, yeah. this is uh, all the project, all the process I did. Yeah. So wow, but I love the project, and um, and I think it's it's going to be a really fun fun one to finish. This way. That way. All right. And then so we will go into my oh. haul, which is from StitchCon, which is still related to StitchCon. Yes. So um, first, oh, I forgot. This gift, this is a gift uh, from Lisa at our next table over. She's on our Sunday Zooms. And she gave me this, she got me this chart. I love the big, big, big crown on top of the house. I mean... I'll take a crown on top of the house instead of a big bird anytime because that looks pretty cool. And then she did a, um, she gave me a, a green, beautiful green silk. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you, Lisa. I will be stitching that, that big house, but you know what? You're evil. You're evil. And you know what you mean, what I mean. Look at all that white. Look at all that white. But I love it. And I'm more than my wife. <laughs> I love it. I love it. So, anyway, uh, base of a lot of the charts that I bought, the designers were there at StitchCon, and I got their John Hancock or Jane Hancock or whatever their signature may be on my projects. So I thought it was pretty fun. So the first one I got was Autumn Seaside, and it's from uh, Forbidden uh, Forbidden Fiber Co. And it's uh, Luann, and she was there at StitchCon. The funny part is, maybe two months ago, I saw this picture on Instagram, and I snagged the picture. I said, oh, I love that picture. I didn't know who the designer was. <laughs> and the model and everything was there. So I got the pattern, and then I got all the threads, all the called-for threads. She, she dyes her own threads. 
So it's Forbidden Fiber Co. threads and fab and uh, pattern. And she also, she's like a, a super, super, super uh, designer, I would say. Because she, she even dyes her own fabric. So, so she, um, so I got the called for fabric, uh, 32 count lullaby, which is the called for fabric and the called for flosses so and the shirt. Uh, they had it if you wanted to cut it in fours. I got, oh, I got a whole yard. Oh, okay. I, All right. It's pretty common. Mm -hmm. So, so I got the whole set. You only need an, you only need an eight, a fat eight to do this project, but I got a whole yard. So I can stitch it a couple okay. of times. But I got some other projects I want to do on the same fabric, so. And then, mm -hmm. um, oh, this, someone found this on the freebie table. And um, I think it was Becky. I think Becky brought this over. I'm probably mistaken. I don't remember but somebody. It's almost, it's called Almost Batty. You know, Lucy Bean. I love Lucy Bean. And it's actually a drum. I found another picture of, this is a top of a drum. And the, the drum has the fabric around it. So it's super cute. Um, I'll be doing some modifications on it because it's called for some wool on the lips and stuff. And I, I've got some really cool general arts wool that I'll be subbing out and stuff. So I think it's going to be fun. I don't know how to do the hair. The hair. Look at that hair. <laughs> oh my God, that's going to be fun. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Uh, I got this beautiful piece of 32 count linen done by, it's dyed by Rivars. Um, I looked at, I saw it the first day, I saw it the third day, second day, and then third day I said it's mine because it, I gave you guys ch a chance to get the green fabric. It will, so last day I got it. And then uh, Cricklewood was there at StitchCon. She sent the next table over to us. Um, and so she had these really cute um, new patriotic pieces. She's an Australian designer that has been um, moved to the United States. Yeah. So she did these on 40 count and they're so cute. They're like this little, but they're so cute. It's America and it's in the shape, the flag is in the shape of the United States. And then the other word is freedom with the eagle there. Those are so cute. And then the other eagle word. Eagle is for me. And then the other one in the series is um, to be home, home of the, the brave. Home of the brave and courage. It's Abraham Lincoln's. Um, Cut out beard and hat. Yeah, you see in the back of the name, so. I know, I could read, but I'm trying to read backwards. <laughs> anyway, so I had her, she, she signed both of them. I made her do it twice. <laughs> 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 so these are my personal copies. And then um, Colleen, Rebel Stitcher, she was there. Oh, this one is a little um, Halloween uh, pin pillow. And look at the skulls on the urn. That was so cool. That's what called my attention. Then again, she also stitched it on 40 count. And I have a picture. I'll post a picture. It's it's like this big. It's, it's literally that big. Wow. And it's so cute. And I'm like, oh, man, she got me. And then uh, Chrissy, finally a farm, farm girl, was there. Um, oh, look. Oh, I got rebel stitchers. Jeez, I got it right there. <laughs> and then uh, Jer uh, finally a farm girl uh, was there also and she had a bunch of her she had a trunk show and I saw Jeremiah he is really really super cute in person this picture does not do him justice I was like I was like oh my god this is so cute so a little Jeremiah there with his little little rat uh, rat friend and there's a little B button on there so I gotta stitch him I might do him on that blue, some of that blue fabric is what I was thinking. And then um, Sue Hillis is the local resident of StitchCon there. Uh, and so she's got a brand new set of designs coming in that's out that's bicycle themed. So I, I thought this one was super cute and she signed it for me. So it's the little, this is the, oh, the summer treats. You know, the bicycle reminds me of Ronnie and the ice cream reminds me of mm, I want ice cream. <laughs> And then she's got all these others, either they're out or they're coming out. So I thought they were pretty cool. There's like a, yeah, I, the B one's not out yet. And I th I saw the snowman one. That's cute. Yeah, super cute. And then while I was looking at her trunk show, I'm like, I had to look through my app. I was like, I, I thought I had this one, but I did not have 
this one, which is one of her older ones. Uh, Halloween party, uh, Halloween party, Halloween memories. Mm. It's so cute. Look at that Frankenstein. He's like, oh, where's the treats? <laughs> really cool. Oh, and I got this uh, Grace Notes uh, blueberry milkshake for this pattern here. But I probably could have used this other fabric, but I wasn't thinking. Yeah. And that is all my haul. Haul. I did pretty good. I yeah. I bought I when I go to retreats I buy memorable pieces. Mm -hmm. So I think I have fun doing that kind of shopping. Um and so we will stop here, clean up, and then pull out what's new in the shop. And it's a lot because it's two weeks worth of what's new in the shop. Yeah. Okay. Be right back. Okay, we're back. We back. We uh we had fun setting up and moving things around. Yes. So we are now showing what's new in the shop. And we're gonna do fabric first. Fabrics. Yes. Everybody loves fabric. This is um, it's white fabric. <laughs> it's forty count Verdell, which is um, which is a um, even weave, forty count even weave. So it's really a nice fabric to stitch on if you want to stitch on a forty count. And this is where's the tag? Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> We're out of practice. This is 32 count vanilla bean by R and R. How's the color look? Look good. Yes. Okay. All right. And this is Simply Sage by Fabrics by Stephanie. Uh, right there. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's a pretty color. Yes, it is. Oh. Nice Christmas project will look good on that. This one right here is Polar Plunge. 32 count Polar Plunge. Is it? Oh, there it is. Is that it? Yes. Yeah. I love this one. Okay, this one is what Stephanie is stitching um, our, the ink circles pattern. Oh, uh, look at that. Wait, uh, there. Yeah. Ah, it's beautiful. Yeah. It's, um, what's it called? <laughs> uh, Seafoam. Seafoam. Yeah. And, yeah, look at that. Oh. It's really hard on these lighter colors. It's hard to show them through because they, they wash out very quickly. But they are like, like candy in person. Love, 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 love it. This is... Jamie's Kilt. Yeah, for those of you who like to watch Outlander. Oh, wow. This is Jamie's Kilt. It's one of her popular this colors. So, did you press me that cardboard? That is okay. gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Oh, this one is. This is 32 count Hocus Pocus. All these are fabrics by Stephanie. Look at that. Oh, oh, wow. I can see like a yeah. solid black stitching would be great for that. Look there. That is gorgeous. Yeah. Or any kind of pumpkin. And that is um, 32 count. Yep. And now we're in, now Ada. we're in the Ada and these are all 18 count Adas. Oh my goodness. This is, I want this one. This I don't is, know when I can stitch on that one, but is. Yummy, yummy. Yep, this is Jamie's Kilt. Fabric by Stephanie. Yeah, very cool colors. All right, and then this one is Seafoam. Seafoam. Look at that gorgeous light green. Yep, very. Oh, wow. Very light minty. Oh, that one. <laughs> Uh oh, <laughs> I think Ronnie's gonna be on the website tonight ordering fabric. There's some there, mm -hmm. and then this this is a, this one will also work well on that ink circle pattern. This is called Polar Plunge, which is good, which is cat well, used for the Kathy Halberman's yeah. designs, the Polar series. I like these uh, bright light colors. Yeah, and then the last one. What is Hocus Pocus? Hocus Pocus. Oh, that's pretty too. Look at that. 
Fucking no. Yeah. Yeah. So wow. I, kn you know what's happening right now, Ronnie? A lot of people are rewinding because we went pretty quick on that fabric show, so they really? went pretty quick. So I'm sorry, he pushed me. <laughs> he rushed me. I think he was rushing to get to the Adas. <laughs> But these are the colors. You can always scroll back, slow it down, stop it, and look at the colors. We can do it again. Nah. They can use the technology. We have technology. Yeah. All right, so now we've got a lot of charts. Oh, yeah. First, we're going with threads. Okay. It's right. coming back or no, no, no. These are new. Um, oh, there's new. There's all actual, are new? Yeah, they're all new. If you give oh, all of them to wow. me, I can group them up. Because yeah. I'm going to pop pictures in. And I... So I contacted Vicky and asked her if she could make a silk thread pack for... I'm going to show this for me, but I'll pop in the really nice pretty picture for you guys. Um, the Loose Feather series. The summer, autumn, winter that you stitch together as one big piece. Mm -hmm. um, these are individual silk packs so you can buy... Instead of putting them all as one giant pack... She put them as smaller packs. You can buy them over time. And the first one is Summer. These are the conversions. And it's got the, the call for name and the con her conversion color there in the paper. And this is Autumn. So Autumn is much bigger. And then Winter. Right there is Winter. And then she has another bundle here, which is, I'm not sure. It says it's extra to stitch all four. It's four extra colors to stitch all three of these. I think that if you're using, I think these are the colors that you might be a little low on if you're going to do it with two they threads. Count. If you do it with two threads, you'll need this extra packet because those are the colors that were close. Uh. And then um, this is one that we haven't carried it before, but this is one that she's already had out there. It's a Blackbird Design conversion color for what what remains is love. Uh, we had a customer ask for that, so we got that for her. And then we had another lady ask for these to be conversions to be made. These are Blackbird Designs from the Garden Club. This is number one, Basket of Cherries. So this is the colors for the Basket of Cherries. Those colors. Mm -hmm. Those colors? Yeah. Yeah, see, Ronnie's not seeing the picture you're seeing, but it's yummy, yummy, yummy. And then number two is the apple orchid, orchid, apple orchard. And that's more, more of the pretty reds and greens. And then the last one is one that I asked her to do for me. It's from Blackbird Design. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. This is my, one of my favorite Blackbird Design patterns I've yet to stitch because it's got Merry Christmas on the top. And it's got some stitching in, and then it's got fleece and down the bottom. So it's kind of married the two languages together. And I thought that was really super cute. Mm. And this one will be one I want to start. It's, it's got look at blue in there. Yeah. It's got a lot of pretty colors, greens, golds. So. You see pictures? You saw pictures. Rewind. Oh my God, so, I love those pictures. Yeah. Okay, so now we, we have, have a frame. Yep, we um, Mill Hills. I did order a couple of Mill Hill charts that you can put in these frames, and of course they were on back order. So I got the frame. So if anyone's looking for a frame to fit the Mill Hill, this is a standard frame that'll fit any of the paper Mill Hill patterns. Oh, okay. So you just you stitch them on the paper pattern. We have we have a Santa Claus one with the clothes. Yeah, and you just stick it right in there, and you're finished. Yeah, we are out or we still have it. Uh, I anyway, think it's, I think it's out. But and then also it's got it's got a place to hang it if you wanted to hang it or a little uh, spool Wood. spool there to make it as a stand up. Yeah. So these are I thought these were really cool because you know when it comes to framing the paper stuff you can frame yourself. Even some of the stitch stuff if it's if it's a small enough. Ronnie's done some like the Frankenstein. Move your head. Move your head like that. Frankenstein right there. Ronnie, Ronnie th um, framed that one for me. He did the pinning and the um, lacing. Yeah. So. Yeah. All right. Now yeah. we're going with charts. Yeah, what are... is the new series? This is the new series. Yeah. Um, this is um, Jingle All The Way. 
parts three and four what they and it's from amy brooken so it comes out every other month you get two pieces every other month to make a larger piece and i'll pop that picture in right here yeah okay and then here is part three which is the santa claus and you get the little um jingle bell that goes on on top of his hat mm -hmm. and then number four is ornaments and you get a bunch of white a bunch of clear beads to make it a snow on top of the you can't see it there. Yeah. yeah you can <laughs> okay, see okay. it. Okay. Put on top of the, the branch there you put the berries. Put the yeah. yeah. So these are clear clear beads. So this is a nice and, project. Yeah, and I was telling Gary, I'm, if I make it I'll just do the ornaments. Yeah. And make a little ornament. Yeah, you could like you can do just the ornament for the Christmas tree or yeah. or smalls exchange. This is yeah. a perfect size for a small yeah. exchange. It's like the like the Santa. You can do only the Santa. You don't have to do. You know what? I don't like my letters. <laughs> I really don't like letters. Really? No, I'm in. But I can do the just the Santa and mm -hmm. make it a little ornament. Yeah, you could. Yeah. But but now the letters are on here, so you can do alignment when you um Mary. When, you, when you connect them. It goes this way. So see yeah. this this is the order see that's the tree right there and so it connects that way yeah so all right so all that's right. that now and then we have going we get a whole bunch of beautiful jbw designs because um i'm like ooh, i love these this is halloween in the round and i like these because you can do them on any count fabric and she also uh, suggests you can use them on a 28 count even weave and do it one over one because it's a small piece. And a little so it wouldn't hats, take that long. Pumpkins and owl. Yeah. And owl. And then this is a and little this rabbits. Is rabbits in the round. And I wanted to see if I can kind of nope. I can't without trying to show the pattern. So you get this pattern and then there's another rabbit inside that you stitch by itself with um this is rabbits in the round. And you then, can do that. That yeah. way. Yeah, that way you can. This one you can do it. This is Christmas in the round. So it shows it there in the red version. And then she gives you the green version to do it in the green version. This is over two. And this will be the green version over one. This is cute. Yeah. So, and then this is the French country crown. You can do it in that way. And then she's got a reverse way where you do it in the dark fabric with a light thread. But you can do any any thread you want. You don't have to do either the colors she does. This is love in the round. And wow. you can just finish it in a hoop as well or on top of a little box. Yes. This is winter in the round. And this is the little, I think she's got that little design in the back for you to do too. And this is a spring in the round. Yeah. I know somebody want to do that one. So greeny. Oh, who? <laughs> All right, let's do her other little book so we keep her together. So this is her brand new release. So the brand new release came out, and that's what sparked me to like say, ooh, I want some of the rounds. So this is uh, Christmas Ornaments number five. It's a limited collector edition because a lot of these patterns were out of print when they were sold individually. So she put them all together in a book that's bound. And then she put them as a collection. So this oh, is a limited wow. collection book. She's been doing one every year so far. So we're up to number five. So you can stitch all the patterns in this book, get you a little tree, and then make you a 2023 tree. Wow. Or nice or cool. pass them out as, as Christmas gifts for office workers or, or your friends. So that was cute. Yeah. And then now we go with the... So these are... We're going to leave these in the package because they're small... Uh, this is from the Gingerbread series. So we have Gingerbread House number three. Luckily, the series is still available. This is this is the series that Ronnie collected for me before he was a stitcher. Remember, you, you were ordering it all over the place? Yes. And this is a Gingerbread Girl and Peppermint Tree. So she's a button, and then you put her, stitch the other stuff. And even contact some of our friends in the group and asking if they can help me to find it. Yeah, and this was ginger. No this idea we will have a store and we. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know you learn, you learn. This is gingerbread boy and snowman. So you either stitch them individually or put them all together in a little village. Yeah, they're so cute. Mm -hmm. 
These are hot off the press. They came in the mail today, just before the video. This is uh, Lindy Stitch's mm -hmm. uh, new designs. She's doing dogs in the garden, and this is num this is summer. This is helping in the in the cornflowers. So remember her first I'm one. Thinking I had to do that. The first one she did was a poodle, frolic frolicking in the daffodils. Oh. This is another doggy. That's so cute. Yeah. yeah. The picture is cute. That I can imagine how yeah, it stitching. looks. Yeah, and especially the cornflowers. And yeah. then she's doing more in her bird series. This is Western Meadowlark. Western. It's a, it's a postcard. She gives you a postcard oh, with information okay. about the bird. So it's a Western uh, Meadowlark. And this is the pattern, the stitched piece. And I gotta make sure I put the card back in there so I don't, cause she got, she put a card in every one of them. This is the next one. This is American, Oh, but okay, you say that. Okay, okay, and then I will show you this. Well, we got it in the shop. Yes. So this is one that I got in the shop that I got at StitchCon. So we have this in the shop now. Yeah. And these are these are cool too. These are new ones. This is from uh, October House. They they're doing these um, skinny. They call it skinny mini pattern. So it's deck the halls. And it's just like 20, was it 23 stitches tall? And so you do a long skinny little pillow. That's a super cute piece. I like their colors. They're very soft. And then there's this next one here, All is Calm. That's cute. Yeah. Oh, this is what, oh, okay. I, I'm still thinking of the, of the sisters and, um, uh, she got that pattern. This is back in the store. Yeah, this is back. This is Christmas Delivery by Cottage Garden Samplings. Isn't that pretty? Look at that Santa. I love those reds. Oh my God. This is gorgeous. This is the new one that just came out. Wow. This is the Coachman number seven in the series in the Snowman Collector series. Look at this. You could just stitch that by itself. You don't need to stitch all of them. I mean, this is super cute. And from your stash. And, and uh, so so I got these for the shop now, so we can show both of them. Yeah. So these are in the shop. So you guys can stitch them along with me when I stitch them. Yeah. And then Ronnie will finish them. Finishing. Build them. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going to start. Well, you just said you were stitch for me. <laughs> All right, and then this is... um. A, more of her series she does halloween stitching so you know kind of like this is number this is number one in the series this is um the land land of the dead gone to a better place series oh it's gone to a better place series and the name of the pattern is land of the dead and it's a skeleton there on a, on a desert island palm tree and stuff it's all stitched with dmc and this is Land of Trouble, number two. Yeah. Actually, closer yeah. To the car. actually, I bought this one last year at StitchCon. Uh-huh. I haven't stitched it yet, but I will. I promise, I will. Mm. And at, at our retreat, Stitching in the Wild, uh, Marja, Mara, Maria, Maria. Uh, stitched and finished two of these Santas. And so it's a little kit. It's the, um, what's it called? It's called, oops. Okay, they didn't put a name on it, but there was a name on the invoice when I put it in there. So it's it's the Santa wine bottle aprons. You get the apron, you get four aprons and you get all the thread. So you get everything to do all four bottles. So that's a pretty good deal. And it's on 14 count Ada. So that's cute. Yeah. yeah. So you can, you can put them on, you don't have to put them on wine bottles. You can put them on any other kind of like water bottles, you know, like the fancy water bottles that's glass. That would be cute because then you could put those, those battery operated well, lights. Some people have um, a collection of bottles. Yeah. Bottles, any bottles. I know, but you could put those little lights in there, little tw twinkle lights yeah. inside the bottle. And that'd be cute to decorate a kitchen. Yeah, for Christmas. Or dining room. Yeah. I like that idea. Yeah, they're yeah. cute. This is the new one from Summer House. 
from Scarlet House. This is her patriotic scissor pocket. Oh no, wait, this is an old one. This is 2016. Okay, so these are new, new to me, new to the shop, but 2016. And this one is <laughs> this, this is, is one of my favorite ones. Pumpkin pumpkin on a vine. How'd you get so very fine? And this is a twenty fifteen. Why did you see the age? The age, yeah. Twenty fifteen. Oh, yeah. twenty fifteen. Yeah. So that was that's one of my favorites. And this one is two four fourteen. Alright, this is Strawberry House and you get the and you do the you know, pattern for the little scissor fob, strawberry scissor fob. Yeah. I've been thinking about strawberries. No, no, no. Yeah. All right, and then this. Said this okay, one. this one I wanted to talk about. This is the Posey collection, and it's a kit. And this is once these are gone, they're gone. We only have two of them, two different patterns from them left in the shop, and so they're going to be pretty much unavailable because Wichelt said they're not. They don't won't have many. They don't have no more. So. Yeah. I just wanted to make sure everyone knew that wanted to get these. There were three of them. Thank you to Tawana. Tawana. Yeah, and many others who kept reminding me to get them. And yeah. I kept trying to get them and get them. And so they've been on back order forever. So we were only able to get the two. We weren't able to get the third one in the series because it's completely gone. So, yeah. And then that's then a, back to the shop. Yeah. Now these, I had to go to um, Beth at Summer House Stitch Works because... Um, once these are gone, they're gone because mm -hmm. she um, she's not reprinting them. So this is the Great Emancipator, and this is Mr. President. So you need to do just the the face or the whole thing. And this is American Ambassador. So it's only two colors. Great little series for President's Day, Flag Day. Oh, I saw this. This is so cute. This is from um, Just Another Button Company, and it's it's a woodland rabbit. Look at who's on the bicycle. You know, I was thinking of Ronnie when I saw this. Isn't it cute? He's just pedaling his little bicycle. I don't pedal. <laughs> and it and it comes with the, it comes with the little buttons, the butterfly button, and uh, the little, there's little buttons on the on the wheels, on the wheels and the spokes right there. And there's some of the little buttons. There's lots of little buttons on this. When screen. a designer do a bicycle with electric motor and stitch it. It looks electric to me. No, he's pedal. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. So this one's back in the shop. This is uh, from Heart and Hand. Uh, Seaside Tiny Town. Mm -hmm. Look at that. You know, I did the Christmas one. You do it as a drum or you do, frame it. Uh, Erica Michaels. This is number two. And this is number one. Oh, yeah, I need that. Okay. okay. So this is a new series that comes out. It's a five. It's a five-part series, and we're up to part two so far. So it's not too late to join the series. So it's a, it's the whole alphabet as quilt uh, blocks, oh, and wow. so uh, this is the first part A B E C's, and it's the A through E. And then this is the second part of quilting ABCs, F which is K. F through K. And so each one of them goes to another piece in this big piece. And then each one of them also has a small mini project that you stitch as well. So the first one has, has this little long pillow. And then the second one has this little square pillow. And I think I just got them mixed up, but I'll make sure I get them right before I put no, them back in the bag. No, here's one and there is two. Okay. Right. And then, oh my lord! I know when I saw this, I'm like, I this is Alice in Wonderland. Oh my god! Isn't it gorgeous? Oh wow! So this is from Nimaway. Oh, and look at that Alice in Wonderland. That is a gorgeous piece. Wow! You get the Chester Cat, you get the Queen of, Queen of Hearts, and you get the Queen of Clubs, and you get the Rabbit and the Clock and the all that stuff around there. It's all DMC. I'm being working in the other building. He doesn't get to see all this I, stuff. Coming. I don't see okay. all this all right. stuff. And then Where this, this, one go this here? It goes with that. Okay. This one's back in the shop. This is my favorite little guy. This is called Robin's Jig. And he goes with those. To me, in my mind, he goes with those um, other 
creatures from the series. They're doing the orchestra series, where it's all those weird animals like the crocodile with the horn and everything. So this is him doing the dance while they're doing the, the music. And there is a ton. Look at all those DMCs that's in this little bird guy. Oh my gosh. I think I'll have to stitch them when Robin stitches them. All right, uh, now we got a couple from Jan Hicks Creates. She's got three, had three new releases in June. This is uh, in her continuation of the series. This is Summer Cottages. I think she's already done Spring and Winter. So they're all hmm. similar, fairly similar. And then this one right here is Love is Love. Another one of her flags. Love the colors. And it's all done with over dyes. There's like one DMC, I think, in the series in that piece. Very pretty. And then uh, this is number six in her series. This is the alphabet, uh, vintage Christmas alphabet. Uh, M and O is the letters. So we've got a few of these. If someone wants to do the whole series, just let me know. We can go back and get the other ones. Oh, this, oh my God, these pieces uh, are so pretty. This is from Haystack Stitching. She's an, uh, a designer from England. She was at StitchCon. I didn't get her yes. to sign my copies, but... Dane? No. Oh. I didn't. Oh. So this is uh, celebrating the coronation of, of King Charles. So it's got the... It's a square pillow. And it's got the Union Jack on there. And then the four corners are the four flowers of the UK. There's like four flowers. She was telling me the story. And, and the story is in the... She's really good about putting the story in, in here. So you can actually read it. And her page, she's got pages and pages with photos, how to finish it, how to do the finishing, where to do this and where to mm. do that. And it's so cute. Yeah, she was doing a little triangle. That's right here. Beautiful. She made something like that. Yeah. Was this one? Uh, something similar to that. No, it was a triangle. Yeah, it, th this triangle. is a triangle. Yeah. That's the triangle? Yeah. yeah it's... And then, so the next one is Liberty. It's a um Oh, I see it, I see yeah. it. So it's a needle book and a, and a scissor fob. Yeah. Yeah. But the, what she do was doing was uh, three different things in the triangle. Yeah. It was gorgeous. Yeah. So. And yeah. now, this is the funny part because I see a flush to her try to pronounce her name too, and she can't. It's Lila. It's Lila? Lila Studios. Yeah. She don't know it's Lila or Lila. The... I, I... <laughs> now I'm confused you <laughs> because we we went through this before and and someone sent it to me phonetically so I could say it right. Okay. And every time someone says it both ways, then I get confused. But anyway, I am so sorry. But uh, this is Let Freedom Ring. And if you're in our Sunday Zoom group, there are a few of you who signed up to stitch this. Uh, start stitching this in January with me. Uh, Lisa, Joy, just to name a few. Was Gina in that? Should we I don't know. Shall we call you all out? I don't know. When they are in Zoom, I'm, I'm working yeah. in the other building. But it's, it, it's a nice book. And I've got maybe one page done. I got like this flower right here, one page. But... This one is here, no? No, I have to frame it. Oh. This one is finished, but it's going to be framed. This is Halloween Quaker. By Leela Studios. Look at that. Yeah. yeah. It's gorgeous. Yeah, that one stitched on murky. I didn't care for the murky look. I got more of a plain gray, so my motifs stood out more. And now a lot of these are back in the shop. Yeah. These are glinted in place. This was from the market. This was a market hit. Uh, the Hungarian folk art number four. The Easter basket, as everyone's been calling it, the Easter basket. So that's that one. <laughs> and this is a good one. I stitched mine on orange fabric over there. So you could stitch it on the green or the orange. And this is which I'm, parking only? You can save it from here. No, you can go get it if you want. I'll hide you. So this is it on green and this is it on an orange. Yeah. So it still looks good. He pops either way. 
I like him, Lawrence. Yeah. I'm thinking in Lawrence pop more. Mm -hmm. I don't know. You decide. Yeah. In my opinion. Yeah, she stitched it on uh, lime green by Zweigart. So. That is very nice. Uh -huh. All right, and then the next one you here. You are working on that yeah, one. Yeah, I started this one. This is Come Sit a Spell. I'm doing this on a on a Changeling, which is a fabric by Stephanie or Banshee. Where's I never other? see this one. I love this. I got. I want to start that one, oh. but I can't start this one until I finish two of my Glinda Places. Oh, this is called it. Spellbound. Look at that. Oh. Isn't that gorgeous? Sorry that my phone. So our next one now is, these are all brand new from Teresa Kogut. This is uh, Sweet Land. People have been calling it Sweet Land of Liberty because that's what's on the picture, but it's actually called Sweet Land. So this is, look at that eagle. Oh my God, I love this one. Yes. She is just amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. And then this is another one from Teresa Kogut. She had like five or six that came out. This is Stitchy Bird. Look at that, it's so cute. It looks very patriotic as well. Stitch Love. Oh, wow, look at this. We're all Stitchy Birds, aren't we? And this is... When... Oh. This is Rapid Growth. When it begins to take root is, is a plant of rapid growth. Oh, we're getting close. We're getting close. Wow. This is um, Wisdom. These are pretty colors. This, I don't know, the threads kind of match what what she used for the uh, Garon exclusive design from the Stagina Wild pattern. It's very similar colors. Love one another. Hmm. I don't know that. Be harmonious. Judge not that ye not be judged. Kindness is wisdom. Ooh. I love that piece. I have to add that to my short list. And this is one of her books. It's got um, three designs in it. It's With Thy Hands. So you've got the main piece here. You've got the little needle book here. And then you got another little piece here. So those are the pieces there. I love this one too. This one's actually back. This was a very hit, mm -hmm. big hit. This is Land That I Love. I saw it at StitchCon. Someone had finished it. Oh, really? And that's why I got more because I'm like, oh. I th looking for it. I don't have that one. But yeah, yeah, the brag the brag table was unbelievable. Yeah. So yeah, this one's on my list to do too. I'm got the brag table maybe three times. You know just so many, so yeah. beautiful that you can Yeah, see it, it it you got me with the strawberries and the patriotic and the eagle. I was like, oh my gosh. Yeah. And now Kathy Barrick, these are brand new from Kathy Barrick. So these all came out right when we when we came back from StitchCon. Yeah, when we came back from StitchCon, all these things were in boxes sitting on the table. Mm -hmm. So this is Stars Stars in My Garden. One of her bird series. Okay. And this is... I have a hard time saying this one because I want to call it uh, Nomenclature of Color Green, but I know it says blue. <laughs> So, Rodney was the guy I was having a problem with the first word, which I did. I tried to read it. <laughs> so this is everything about the blues, 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 and more blues. Yeah. Oh man, why they do that to me, Kathy? Isn't that pretty? Oh man. Look, look at the yeah. This is Fractor Flowers. Look at that. And it's even got. It's got the ABCs in there, but they're hidden. They don't even, you don't even notice there was ABCs. Yeah. And then I love this one. This is Crowns of Blue. I see that one's in, uh, in the Bragg table. No, not this one. No, was that one? No, there was one similar. This just came out. Okay, sorry. Yeah, these are brand Somebody brand else, new. but was one the with yeah. Crowns. Oh, that was, was... that was um, Rosewood Manor. Kingdom of Crowns. Oh, that one dark color. Oh, yeah. that was. Yeah, they did it on a dark fabric. Normally, you see it on a white fabric with the, with all the metallic threads, but they did it on a dark fabric. I was like, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. And this is uh, from Finally a Farm Girl. These were in her trunk show, 
This is Patriotic Matilda, and she this was finished as a drum. It's so cute. I love the little tomato there. Yeah. I don't know, the picture is kind of, it's off center, the picture, but you can see what it is. Yeah. And of course, there's Jeremiah. I got Jeremiah. Jeremiah is, um, is a bullfrog. Yeah, he. There's Jeremiah, and then uh, there's Jenny, his girlfriend. She's stitching. Jenny's a stitcher. Oh, okay. Miss Jenny. All right. So, I want to see Miss Jenny right here. She's stitching. And then Matilda the mouse, I saw her finished. This was so cute. Well, I think we've got some of the, yeah, we have some of this thread, but we've got the antique version of the ribbon. Mm -hmm. The ribbon here, we got the antique version of it, not the white, white, but look at that. So that would be cute, finished off. And you can stick, it, I, you, I think it'd be, I think there's little pins stuck in there. I don't think those are French knots. They could be French knots. Um, Chrissy is a French knot uh, guru. She uh, she's the one who stitched the um, breakfast with breakfast with Santa Christmas mm -hmm, morning breakfast, mm -hmm. and she did all the French knots in the beards and hair, which weren't charted, but she just like loves those French knots. Oh. oh, and then we have this one in the shop. So, so I figured if I was going to stitch it, there may be others. This is brand new from Shepherd's Bush in their bat in that uh, bag series. I looked, the purple bag is not out yet, but the moment I can get my hands on the purple bag, we'll have it in the shop. This is my sheep bag. And you stitch it with the pearl that cotton. I know what the Joseph was stitching. He was stitching on one of the bags. Oh, no, was that one? No, he was stitching oh, on the blue oh, one. Yeah. Oh, okay. So this is um, my sheep bag. Yeah. Oh, look at it. another one from Cricklewood. Joseph was uh, one of the metal stitchers and a stitch card. Yeah. Hi, Joseph. Yeah, Joseph was my lifesaver. I had a hangnail that uh, was bleeding and he had band-aids. Oh. And lo and behold, I didn't know I had two packages that had two had band-aids in it, but I needed the band aid <laughs> Thank you, Joseph. <laughs> All right, so here is another Halloween. This was her first Halloween one that I saw, the first Stitch Con, I believe, or second one. This is uh, Witchy Witchy from Cricklewood. This is really cute. And when, I, and when I saw it stitched, it was like, oh my God, it's amazing. 2020 was a, is the date on this one. So that's when it came out. And we're going to Barbara and Designs. Yeah, uh, there are actually three of these. Oh, um, there's- I have three here. No, no, there's three of this right here. Uh, this is a, um, it's a one, two, three series. Uh, Ronnie only pulled one, but we have all three pieces. So this is what the piece looks like completely finished. Oh, I see. It's all three pieces. But we have, it's like one, they come out as one little band. So this is band number three, but we do have one and two as well. Uh, so you could either do them. I've seen them done as the complete piece, and I've seen people complete them as drums. So they look kind of cute as drums. Okay. So well, you know, do the board probably. Yeah, they didn't the do the drum. border. They didn't do the border yeah. when they did the drum, but it was it was kind of cute. I thought it was really cute. It's all just DMC. And see it there, and I'm thinking it's all the same. Yeah. So that's why I want to make sure you. I did put one, two, and three in the computer, so you'll know if you want all three pieces. You got to get those pieces. Okay. And this is a brand new one. This is called Wanted. Wanted ten thousand X stitches reward. Cause the frog made you do it. <laughs> I love that one. And this is cool. Oh, I like that one. This is a very patriotic with a big bird. Long may she wave. And Uncle Sam. Uncle Sam is on on a blackbird bird. with the flag. I've seen this one in a, for a while and I just like, ooh, it's a 2013. I'm like, oh, I kept forgetting to get it. Wow. So that is all we have back in this That's all we have in back this in the shop. And so, yes, I know we now. We now going, I know we've made you guys wait an hour. Wait, we go to announcements. We have announcements. Yes, I'm finished this week with my Saint Jude bags, mm -hmm. and I want to explain a little bit to everybody who never uh, buy my uh, Saint Jude or my charity bag. 
the way we work the charity bags every year is we buy the materials and make the bags and every penny we make in the sale of the bags is go to our charities, what is St. Jude Children's Hospitals and um, Trainer. Trainer's Hospital. Trainer Hospital. And this year I make 100 million bags, which cost $20 to you. And I make 100 mini bags, what is uh, $12. $12 a piece. And to total go be, 3200 because what we do before is we stop the sales in Garon Stitchery and you sell for a couple hours the bags. But this year, oh, and I'm doing it on my birthday. But this year, uh, we go doing a regular sale bags, including the St. Jude bags, but we know it's going to be 3200 that we go pull out. Right. And what we'll do is, so you'll know which one, we'll put the name of the bag and we'll put it in the comment. You know, it'll be the name of the bag and it'll be dash charity bag. Ronnie's, yeah, but the name of the bag is going to be called Ronnie's charity bag. So you know, oh, okay. So you know, oh, my money is going for a charity for this bag. This money is going to those two guys. Yes. <laughs> yes. So we want to be upfront and clear. Yes. Upfront. So, yes. So you want to say, say, you know, the amount of their charity go be collected, go be. 3200 yeah, and, and there when we sell every single bag for the charity we divide the total and we send in half to st jude st jude and half to shriners Shriders. <laughs> and there we show you guys yeah. the our receipt that we give the money i know how to do that but i like you guys to know that that money is really take care mm -hmm. for our charities yeah. and um the and I say they are done, but I'm going to change this year the time to. It's going to be in the first week of July because one, I'm leaving the country for Costa Rica mm -hmm. for my little trip. And second, I'm thinking because uh, the 4th of July is, uh, the 5th of July is my heart attack anniversary. And I'm thinking it's uh, appropriate for. So we'll do the first week of July. For that. We'll, we'll get the exact date. Yes. Because he's just spitballing right now. So you guys. Yeah, when, I, when I, I don't when have it? exactly the day, but I think I'm, I'm, a, I'm I know it's uh, um, the first weekend. The first weekend of July. Of July. Well, yeah. most sure because I'm finished the other bags for the regular sale um, in this week. Okay. I'm being working crazy for. Before StitchCon and after StitchCon. Okay, I have a question for you. Yes. Do you ever not work crazy? No. Okay, so it's <laughs> so it's really your normal. Yes. <laughs> okay, so you've been working normal. <laughs> yeah, All right. that's true. So that being said, it will... That was up. Uh, yeah, when we get closer, it. we'll give you the exact date yeah. and time. Next video i will tell you exactly what day yeah and then we'll put it in and we'll also put it in the um in the website when well, we put it in the website when you open up the garwan totem bags section in the website and it'll say the next bag sale is this day this time and, and we that. will announce in the facebook groups yeah so we'll yeah. keep you guys all informed yeah all right, that is so, my announcement. I don't know if you had any announcement or not. But okay, uh, we have a very, very big announcement, but I'm waiting really? till another 30 seconds. So it can be, so you guys have had to wait an hour and 45 minutes. Oh, you see. To mean. hear the good news. Uh, those of you that's in our Facebook group. On um, Estition in the uh, Wild Estition group. in the Wild group already know this information, but for the rest of the world, Yes. We will be doing Stitching in the Wild 2024. Yes. In okay. September of next year in the state of Alabama. In the Mag city of Montgomery. Montgomery. The capital of Alabama. The capital of Alabama, yeah. yeah. So we, we signed the contract yesterday for the hotel. So we're all signed up for the hotel. Yes. So we will be... Um, so it will... The, the event will be from September the 12th to September the 15th of 2024. Yes. And we will do the sale on the website for the tickets, for the entry fee on August the 12th, 2023. 
So this yeah. And after September 12th, the hotel will be open the for reservations. The, for reservations. Yeah. Yes. So, so that because we had to do the sale on August because the hotel tell us they go open the link the, for the sale for the room block. Room blocks. Yes. Yeah. So that way it'll give you a couple of weeks to get prepared for the for the room block. And it'll go on sale on August the 12th, 24th, August the 12th, 2023 at 2 p.m. It's a Saturday. Okay. Central Central Standard Time. So if you're in New York, minus an hour. <laughs> yes. And I'm not going to do the math for the other states. You know where you're at. Yeah, we go yesterday. We drive yesterday, and uh, we uh, we're uh, walking around the Sarandas and we love the area. Mm -hmm. uh, they have the river walk. River. Yeah, there, there's a river. there's a boat you can oh, you can you can go on the river cruise. Yeah. And there's uh, there's a couple of national museums. There's a Hank Wayne Museum there. There's a Rosa Parks Museum there. Is that restaurant? It's like a court. Court, um, courtyard restaurant yeah. is what we're calling and they have Italian, Mexican, mm -hmm. uh, Starbucks is mm -hmm. right there Starbucks. around the corner. Yeah. And and there's a Jimmy John's. So there's a lot Jimmy of little John's. restaurants that are not chain restaurants, which is kind of fun because then you get a little bit of a local flavor. Yeah. Local flair. Yeah. Uh, we we make a little video and uh, we'll put it, we go put we'll, it. We'll edit and put it together at the end. Yes. Because I haven't even looked at it to see how well we did. <laughs> well, it's not like Sarah's video that she do for our session in the wild in Florida, but we try. Yeah. But yeah. It was... uh, Sarah is, was one attendee in our group, Sarah and Bridget, yeah. her mother. They were so kind and they do a mini video. or well, they do a video, the surrounders of the hotel in, in, uh, before the, yeah. our, in Fort Lauderdale. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. My so, tongue stuck. Yeah. You were trying to say Fort Worth. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, um, uh, I think it's going to be really great. Um, there are some good goodies coming out from that. We'll yeah. piecemeal it through to you guys and we'll give you more information. Yeah. And we'll have more information in the, in the, in the thing, in the post for it to go on sale. Um, and then we'll keep, then we'll add you to the group, the Sajina Wong group. Yes, right. but that is the big news. Big, big news. We it's taking for a while to us to find a. The we right. coming from the station in the wall in May, and then we start looking and looking and looking and looking, and finally, thanks God, we find a beautiful, beautiful place. Yeah. yeah, you know when you live in a rural area, you have to keep going till you find a bigger city for one, and two, yeah. we just didn't want a, a, you know, we wanted to. We didn't. We wanted to keep it the same number of people we had this year. Yeah. We wanted to keep it at the 125, so that way it would keep. Mm -hmm. You know. Yeah. Here it would be a lot like 20 people going to a retreat. That's not a retreat. <laughs> yeah. And no, we were not going to have people sleep in the backyard. <laughs> no. Princess Leah. It's said, too far away. It's yeah. one and a half hour yeah. riding. Right and Princess Leah said that's her backyard. No one's allowed in there. Yeah. <laughs> All right. No tents allowed. <laughs> yeah. So. Um, Wow, it's been a lot going on this week. I mean, we came back from StitchCon and we ran around and did that. Yes. And um, it was really good. That fun day yesterday. Uh, do we have anything else? Mm, not that I know. Yep. Nope. Not, nope. All right. Nope. So thank you, everyone. And uh, see you next time. Bye-bye. Love you, Zhao. Hi, everyone. Hi. Uh, we are Garon Citri. I'm Ronnie. I'm Gary. And you can see us on YouTube at Garon Stitchery, or you can visit us on Facebook at Garon Tokenbacks. And we have a website that you can purchase from us at garon stitchery.com. Having fun at StitchCon. Thank, Thank you. you. Hi, this is Candy, the 614 Stitcher. And you can find me on Instagram, Facebook, and FlossTube at the 614 Stitcher. Thanks. Hi, I'm Fawn. And I'm Sean. And we're Sanctum Stitching. Sanctum Stitching. <laughs> um, I am Sanctum Stitching on Instagram. And I am Sean M. Stevens90 on and Instagram. Come talk to us on YouTube. We love talking about birds, all our house issues, and we stitch all the things. And our favorite so. cat. 
Bye. Hi, I'm Bobby, Pumpkin Creek Primitives. You can get me on YouTube at Pumpkin Creek Primitives, Instagram, Pumpkin Creek Primitives, and our website, pumpkincreekprimitives.com. Okay. Hi, guys. My name is Ymir. I go by all my m ms on FlossTube, Instagram, website, and all that good stuff. So if you would like to find me, you can just find the all my m ms somewhere near you. Bye. Good. Hi, I'm Leanne, and I am Leanne.Stitches on YouTube and on Instagram, and I am also Forbidden Fiber Co. on Instagram or www.forbiddenfiberco.com. Hi. Hi there. I'm Angie. I'm the Tiny House Stitcher, and you can find me on YouTube at Tiny House Stitcher or Instagram at Tiny House Stitcher. I have a website, www.tinyhousestitcher.com. So come and check out my channel and join my tiny tribe. Thank you. Hey everyone, happy uh, Saturday from <laughs> StitchCon. I'm Christy Bernstein, Salty Stitcher Designs. And um, come check out my website and my Instagram, Facebook, all at saltystitcherdesigns.com. So, okay. thanks. Hi, I'm Karen, Recovering Monogamous Stitcher on both FlossTube and Instagram. My FlossTube channel is mostly about cross-stitch, but it's also about quilting and other sewing crafts. I hope you'll stop by sometime to see me. Hey, I'm Sylvia Sticker, Running with Needles and Scissors. You can find me on FlossTube, Running with Needles and Scissors. My website is Running with Needles and Scissors, but you can type in www. R W A N S, so you don't have to type the whole thing. And I'm on Instagram, running with needles and scissors. Shout out from StitchCon. Okay. Hey, my name is Sarah. I'm from Memphis, and I have a channel about cross stitch. My channel name is the same as my Instagram. It is Memphis Sarah E. Having a great time at StitchCon weekend. I would love for y'all to come check out uh, my channel. In addition, we also have a local. Stitch Together group called 901 Stitchers with my friend Zan, Crazy Van Lady Stitches. If you're local to us or passing through Memphis on a weekend, you know, check out our Facebook group and come join us. Hi, I'm Zan Lansiddle. I'm Crazy Van Lady Stitches on Instagram and I have a floss tube. It's about cross stitch, quilting, sometimes crochet, maybe not, <laughs> not a lot, but come and check me out. Thank you. Bye. Hi, Floss Tube friends. I'm Connie. I'm Melina. And, and we are Count Twice Stitch Once. On Instagram, I am Count Twice Stitch Once. And mine is Melina Stitcher. And we just talk about our cross stitch projects and Maybe. whatever other crafty stuff we have going on. <laughs> That's about it. Great. See ya. Hi, I'm Janelle, Coffee Wine and Stitching Time. And I have a Floss Tube about cross stitch, yarn, and anything I want to talk about. And don't expect any actual routine because there's just lots of haul and lots of stuff and whatever it is, it is. So come check me out. Thanks. Smile, sparkle, shine. Hi everyone. I'm Tammy with Creative Country Girl. I have a floss tube channel on YouTube. You can watch me at Creative Country Girl, Tammy Blaylock. I talk about all my stitching, my sewing, my quilting, and my oh, okay. back banking. Okay. So, uh, come to YouTube, find Creative, Creative Country Girl, and I'm going to have a new video very soon. Bye. See you. Hi, it's Janet. Janet with Janet Jabber. You can find me on all socials at Janet Jabber. Hi, I'm Liz. Hi, I'm Shelly, and we're the Antique Needleworkers. You can find us on Instagram, Antique Needleworkers, or at the Wide Ring Stitcher and Shelly Fry Five. Bye-bye. Hi, I'm Colleen, Rebel Stitcher. Uh, you can find me on Instagram at Rebel Stitcher Designs, or my website is rebelstitcher.com. Thank you. Yay! Hi, I'm Christine. You can find me at Mountain Crafts Studio. Hi, I'm Christine from Hollow Sands Create. You can find me at Hollow Sands Create at my shop or on Instagram or at McMama Hollis. Thank you. Welcome to Whips and Sips. I'm Justine. And I'm Shelly. You can find me on Instagram at Shelly underscore Kine. It's spelled K-A-I-N. And you can find me at Welcome21 on Instagram. Thank Thanks. you. Bye-bye. Hello, I'm Abby, I'm Top Knot Stitcher. You can find me on FlossTube at Top Knot Stitcher, Instagram, Top Knot Stitcher, my shop, topknotstitcher.com. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> and goodbye. <laughs> Hi, I'm Lynn from Linux Stitches Creates. You can find me at um, FlossTube at Linux Stitches Creates and Instagram at Linux Stitches Creates. Okay.
Hi everyone, I'm Seattle Stitcher. You can find me as the Seattle Stitcher on Flosstube and Megan underscore Pagata on Instagram. Hey y'all, it's Bridget, the Museum Stitcher. You can find me on Flosstube at the Museum Stitcher and Instagram as the same name. Hi everyone, my name is Will Smith and you can find me on Flosstube and Instagram as Frizzability Stitches. Cool. Hey all you lovely people, my name is Alexis. You can find me at Alexis underscore my amazing world on Flosstube and on Instagram. Hey everybody, Mr. Hollick here. I'm at StitchCon 23. I'm a floss tuber and just thought I'd say hi and introduce you to myself. Yeah, that's right. Uh, stop by and visit me at uh, youtube.com slash Mr. Hollick, M-R-H-O-L-L-I-C-K. Uh, my Instagram is sean.hollick, S-E-A-N dot H-O-L-L-I-C-K. And uh, Facebook is Mr. Hollick, M-R-H-O-L-L-I-C-K. Sorry, I don't have a uh, MySpace anymore, but um, that's okay. Anyway, stop by. I'd love for you to stop by and check out some of my videos. Um, uh, I haven't made one for a little while, but I'm going to have a big, uh, big uh, comeback video here soon after StitchCon. So be sure to check it out. <laughs> hey there, guys. It's Liz Matthews here. I have a floss tube as well as a company called Hello from Liz Matthew. You can find me on Instagram under the same name. I share behind the scenes of new and upcoming designs as well as all of the things I love in the community. Hope to see you there. Hi friends, this is Jessica the Sweetwater Stitcher and I am on YouTube at Sweetwater Stitcher. I'm on Instagram at same name Sweetwater Stitcher where I share my whips, my current or finishes, upcoming projects, and all kinds of other things. I even have some tutorials. So come and follow me there. Hope to see you there. Bye! Hi Stitchy Friends! Hi Stitchy Friends! I'm Sarah and I'm Jen and we are the Stitchy Friends. <laughs> you can find us on YouTube at Stitchy Friends. Um, we also have an Instagram, Stitchy Friends underscore or Stitchy underscore Friends. Yes. And and we just we like to share what we're stitching and what we're buying and what we're doing and what we're planning and all the things. So we hope you guys will join us and, and check us out. Thanks. Okay. Bye guys. Hi, I'm Chantel with 141 Design Company and you can find me on Instagram at Chantel's 141, on Facebook at Chantel Dimeling 141 Design Company, and my new website which is Chantel's 141.com. And what I offer are DIY woodcut finishing solutions for all of your cross stitch projects. I'm here at StitchCon, have a blast. Make sure you're here next year. Thanks. Hi, it's Jody Smith. I'm Simply Stitching Ocala from Ocala, Florida. You can follow me on the same uh, handle at uh, Simply Stitching Ocala on YouTube and Instagram. Hope to see you all next year. Bye. Hello, Stitchy friends. My name is Carrie, and I am Tiger Lily Designs. I am on FlossTube and YouTube and Instagram and Facebook and all the places. You can come and join me. I try to do a FlossTube every Friday just to share what I'm working on. I also have a Project Keeper, maybe you've heard of it, subscription box. It's a quarterly club that I try to join, but my website is www.tigerlilyshop.com or tiger.lily.designs and all the places. See you soon. Happy stitching. Hi, everybody. <laughs> we are Stuck Harbor Crafts. We are. And my name is Debbie. And I'm Kefri, and this is Maverick. And we are here at StitchCon, yep. and we would like um, to introduce you, if you've never seen us, we are on Floss Tube. Yeah. And Instagram, uh, Instagram. Facebook. Yep. Uh, all the places. Stuck and Harbor Crafts. That's right. And then uh, every October, we do a retreat. Yeah, it's called Stitch West. Stitch West in Salt Lake City. Yeah. yeah. And it's a lot of fun. Um, this year, it's October 13th, 14th, and 15th. And we're full for now, but we will be announcing some in the maybe future. Maybe two retreats. Yeah, maybe two. Maybe and more. And we I will keep you posted. If you want to find out more information, just go to Snug Harbor Crafts. Yeah. And you will be able to find us. Yeah, we'd love to have you. Fun. Bye. See ya. Everybody. I'm Judy Whitman with JBW Designs. Oh, I have a floss too. It's JBW Designs. And I also have an Instagram account. It's Judy.Whitman. I also have a Friends of JBW Designs Facebook page. And I sell my patterns um, almost exclusively through needle workshops and um, through distributors. So if you see a pattern that you've been wanting to get, I would encourage you to contact your local needle workshop 
or write to me at Judy at JudyWDesigns.com and I can give you a shop as a, a source. So thanks a lot. Bye-bye. Hey Flossy, welcome back to Basic Stitches. I'm Jordan and I'm on Instagram at Jordan X Stitch. And I'm Jamie and I'm on Instagram at Jamie X Stitch. That's how we start all of our videos on our channel, Basic, Basic Stitches. Stitches. I'm a designer. Um, I am a little stitch girl. I've been designing for about five years. Yeah. Five or six okay. years. Um, and we love Floss Tube and the whole community and everything it's done for Cross Stitch. Um, within the last year, Mom started designing too, also under a little stitch girl. Stitch girl, yep. On Floss Tube, it's basic stitches slash little stitch girl. Yep. On Instagram, all those. Um, I'm also on TikTok at little.stitch.girl. I post all of them to Instagram as reels too, but we have a lot of fun making silly videos. Thanks, bye. Bye. Hi guys, it's Chrissy finally a farm girl. We're coming to you this afternoon on almost our last day. Is it our last day? Yeah. Almost yeah. last day. Because we will be getting back on the road tomorrow, but we are having a great time yep. at um, StitchCon Weekend A. So our floss tube is Finding a Farm Girl and Stitchy Linda. And we are going to get back to you real soon after uh, Weekend A and after our travels and after we rest just yes, a little, just bit. A little bit. And we'll be excited to show everything that we uh, experienced at StitchCon 2023. This uh, is finally a farm girl. <laughs> you do this. <laughs> and her patents are finally a farm girl. And you can find them at all your distributors and your local leader work stores. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, and, and soon in uh, late, I believe it's late August, mm -hmm. at uh, Needlework Marketplace, which is a virtual market, and um, you will be seeing new designs then from me, and you will be able to order and do your typical me pleases and do some pre orders. So we are working on those right now. And so there's some cute ones coming. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a very special one coming. Thank That's you. Right. Have a great time. See ya. Bye okay. guys. Hi, I'm Christy from Kinder Ramblings. My Instagram handle is CG0. I think that's it. <laughs> Bye. Hello from Florida. I'm Melissa Neely. I'm Neely's Needle Nest. I, my Instagram handle is also Neely's Needle Nest. N E E L E Y is my last name. I also do finishing, so um, anytime you want to do finishing, most of what you'll see from me on Instagram and in my uh, videos are on finishings. Hope to see you soon. Okay. Hi, I'm Kathy Ratliff at Kathy's Corner. I have a floss tube, and I sure hope you would want to come and check me out. I finish things. I have a Friday finishes called Fabulous Fun Friday finishes that you can check out. I also have, besides floss tube, some gardening videos and such. Um, I would love for you to check me out. I'm on Facebook, that's it. I'm on Facebook at Kathy's Corner and Instagram at Kathy's Corner 2021. So check me out, bye. an Italian restaurant. It's across the street from the hotel almost. Mexican cuisine restaurant in the corner. This is like a core court rest, courtyard restaurant, and uh, it's almost across the hotel. And you can see over there. Well. Very glory. That's a nice area. But oh I cannot see it. Starbucks is exactly in the front. But it's too shiny. Now you can see 
There is a Starbucks. There is the alley where um, the restaurants are. And we walk in all the way here. This is uh, a restaurant, but I don't know what is the name where we are and the hotel is right there right there is the hotel and go to another little video in the car at this uh, restaurants are walking distance or it's very cool we are leaving the parking lot of the hotel Where you can see the distance from the restaurant's court. There is the river front when I take a picture of the Gary. There's an Italian restaurant and a Mexican restaurant. It's called the Alley. And this side is another restaurant in the corner there. And uh, Jimmy Jimmy Joe was the in the court restaurant. Mm -hmm. uh, Seven nine eight is a, a restaurant there. Another seafood restaurant. It's a nice, um, oops, sorry. <laughs> it's a nice little area. And now we go heading to. Please proceed to the highlighted route. 